Hi, I'm Joe with Family Handyman. You know, we get a lot of inquiries about doing projects with kids. Well, I found this Bluebird house kit on Amazon. All you need is a screwdriver and a hammer to put it together. Let's get started. Okay, what comes in the box, two sides, a back, your door, the roof, bottom, some screws, and a sticker sheet. Okay, this is the finished product. This is what it's gonna look like. If you'd like, you can paint the birdhouse completely after it's all assembled, or if you just wanna paint the roof, it may be easier to paint it before you start assembling it. First step to this birdhouse assembly is putting the sides onto the bottom, attaching them. Um, one thing you wanna think about before you do that is some of these boards are warped. They have a cup to them. And so if you put them together against the bottom, you're gonna get this little wiggly attachment. So to remedy that, we'll put the cup of the board to the inside and then we'll attach it. So just got to kind of sight the board down. It's come some basic woodworking, sight the board down and then put the cup part in, the concave part in. Okay, to attach, we're going to first attach the left side to the bottom. Now they've pre-drilled the holes, the through holes on the side, but they haven't pre-drilled them on the bottom. So this is why I want to use a hammer just to get the screw started, tap it in, and then we'll, we'll drive it home with the screwdriver. The first step to this is you want to have the back of your left side flush with the back of the bottom. I like to hold the side in my two fingers, between my fingers and thumb, and then push down on the bottom. So I'm holding that flush with the back. Put a screw in the side here, give it a little tap. It's going to be easier to move your piece over to the edge so your screwdriver is off the edge. Same thing with the second screw. We got the side and the bottom attached. Let's attach the other side. This would be the right side. This here is the back side. Again, you want to have it flush with the back of the bottom. Sometimes I like to Maybe even put a board next to it so you can feel that it's flush. Now we'll put the next screw in. Give it a little tap. Let's move it all over to the edge now. Now we're going to put the second screw of the right side in. Now we have these three parts joined together. We're going to move on to the back. Again, you want to sight the board down, put the, the cup, the concave part of it, into the inside. That'll, that'll enable it to contact to the, each board better. Another thing to keep in mind is that the backboard is, is cut just a little bit wider than the sides, than the actual birdhouse. So you're going to want to have this overhang on each side about an eighth of an inch. And of course, flush with the bottom. All the boards are flush on the bottom. Now I'm going to attach the back with two screws. All right, back is assembled. Next is the door. We're going to put the front door on. You can choose to put the, the wood link logo in or out. Uh, I'm going to stick it in, okay? Uh, with this door, what I found is the way they have these drilled is you want to have this flush with the front. So the door, the face of the door is flush with the front of the two sides. And the best way to do that is to lay it on its front. Now I'm going to attach the door. I'm going to stick my hand inside the birdhouse and hold my hold the door down with my hand. Put the screw in the hole and give it a little tap. Now we'll add the second screw to the door the same way. Okay, the door is attached. Now these these screws that hold the door on they don't have to be driven all the way home. You can back them out just a little bit so the door will open. Yeah, like that, because the door is undersized a little bit. All right, next we're going to put this low-tech security system on here to keep the door locked. It's, it's basically an L screw that just goes into the front and just turn it in all the way. 
And all that's left to this project is the roof. The, uh, the beveled edge of that is gonna go against the back. Again, this has a, a little bit of an overhang and a reveal that you wanna feel on the edge that it's equally on both sides. The roof attaches with three screws. There's two on the top and then one in the back. Again, get it started with a hammer. And the back one goes on the top hole. There it is, all assembled. Cute little birdhouse. You can paint it, put some stickers on it, mount it on your house or on a fence post. Enjoy the birds, everyone. For more tips like this, visit us at familyhandyman.com.